Hello and welcome to a new episode of Nervo Green Glass. So today, as you know, we're a fan of the Evo here. I found a Time Attack Evo for a set of Corsa. I'll put the link in the description for the download if you want to try it out. But this is 1,017 horsepower and it is fast. So it's probably the fastest Evo I can find. So I thought, let's take it around the Nürburgring. Ring. Now, I have taken my Evo around the Nürburgring. Yes, it was an FQ360, but we turned down the boost, so it's an FQ320 now. Um, we took it around the Nürburgring, Ring, and that did a, I, I thought, a pretty uh, handsome time. Let's see what this is gonna do, because this is got some serious aero, and it is pretty fast. So, I think the only thing to do is, let's get to it. Right, here we go. Let's wind it up. First gear, final corner on the power, up through the gearbox, third, I'm going to book the limiter, back down to second, get the nose in, come on, come on, come on, pulsating the accelerator pedal there, just, just try and keep up boost pressure, right, down here we go, up to fifth, flat out through there, get into that camber, rides the bump so well this car does, gearbox didn't like the early downshift though, right, bit of third, use the curb there, Back down to second, just to point the car in the right direction there. Use all the kerb on the exit there and a bit extra. Right, back in the right direction. Hard on the power. Right, up through the gearbox. Going to be flat out now for a good slog down here. Up over the bridge, towards the plunge back. Completely flat, sick gear. Turn it in. Easy now. There we go. Right, now those big wings are going to turn into big parachutes. You can still see we're edging towards 200 miles an hour. This thing is ridiculously fast. Flat out for Shreven points. And then hard on the brakes. All the way down to second. Come on. In, 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 in. There we go. Oh, I had to get out of the floor a little bit there because we've got steer has got on the power too aggressively. But we we'll carry on. All the way down through the uh, foxholes. Up to sixth already. Flat out through the compression. Dab a brake. Up over the rise. Two more gears. Come on, turn in. Use a bit of power. Right, down to second. Right, got to just try and keep up good speed through here. You can hear me pulsating the throttle again just to try and keep up the boost pressure. Right, fifth gear, past the rebel tree. Are we going to get sick? Don't think so. We're actually going to need four. There we go. And then hard again on the brakes, down to second. Flames coming out the bonnet. There we go. Up over the rise. Back down two gears. Come on, try and stay a bit closer to the curb there. I'm going to use all the power on the exit. Right, we're going to have a dab. <laughs> dab. And then flat out through there. Back down to fourth. Get the nose in and then use all that aero grip. Can really fit build in there. Right. Attack it as much as possible here. We're actually going to go down to first. Get the nose in and then stamp the throttle. And then you're just literally holding on for the rest of the section there. Already up to fifth. I'm going to use second here. Just try and get the car to rotate a little bit better and get it into that curve there we go right up the hill we go third fourth fifth Whoa, this is a workout flat out through there and then hard on the brakes again we're going to use second just try and keep the car down nice and low right as i always say any car that accelerates up here is scary now this car will accelerate but the amount of aero grip actually starts to feel less scary at this kind of speed feel more confident if that makes sense so i think i need to readjust any car that goes up here that still accelerates and doesn't have aero grip is scary right dab has brakes down to fifth back on the power come on wait for the boost the boost is starting to come back now add the lift the heck we've got a lot of understeer oh trying to go down into first there we've got what gear i was in right power Right, so how's this going to take the carousel? Up to fourth already. Going to get on the brakes nice and early. Tip it in. We don't want to pop out if we can avoid it. Just try and keep up the throttle. There we go. Power all on the exit. There we go. Right. This roller coaster section. This is where the car should be good. Fifth gear through there. Third. Yeah, it looks about right. There we go. Up over the rise. We're going to take second get that nose turned in there we go right down the hill we go on the curb a little bit there right this is gonna be fun use a curb use a bit more curb 
third come on power 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 sometimes it is a bit disconcerting when you get on the power and there just isn't the power you're, you've been expecting because you're just not in the boost going to use second through there just to pull the car through the corner more than anything oh come on come on needed maybe second there going to take second for this corner and then aim it at the horizon oh right flat out come on fifth gear dab a brake down one gear get it turned in oh a lot of understeer there right but we're back on the power this section is going to be hold your horses kind of thing hold on to your nutsacks right over the camber oh, wow that was a good workout gonna break early for this section here so we can power through it corner that I hate the most on this circuit gives me a lot of understeer again there we we'll actually take second for the second carousel power there we go right up through the gears third four I'm gonna get on the brake try and avoid hitting the curb I'm on the power Oh, got to steer. Had to get out of it. Oh, I probably could have done it flat. But I actually bottled it, hitting the curb there. Right, sixth gear. Down that dotting her we go. Right, not much left of the lap now. What kind of speed we're doing? Almost 200 miles an hour. Oh, sorry if I sound out of breath. Right, under the Bilstein Bridge we go. Might hit 200 miles an hour as we go down here. Just about, there we go. Right, flat out for the chicane. And then hard on the brakes. Could have maybe gone a little bit deeper. That's what she said. Right, final corner, first gear, turn it in. Power, right, up through the gears. And across the start, finish line. Whoa. Oh my God. This thing is brutal. Absolutely brutal. It still feels like an Eva though, because you can get on the power mid-corner and point the steering where you want the car to go and it will drag, drag the car that way. But, wow, that was a lot of fun. My wrists hurt now though. Um, yeah, uh, I've put the time up on the screen so you can see what kind of time. I can't see what time is because I A, didn't check and I think this does uh, the wrong timing gate. So, I enjoyed this, I hope you guys did. If you did, like it. If you didn't, dislike it. If you didn't dislike it, just let me know in the comments down below how I can make it better. And uh, I'll see you again soon for another one. Bye.